Welcome back, Ohana. Or if you're new to my channel, welcome. My name is Thomas, and this is Stitches Ohana. So we are just one day away from the giveaway winner announcement video. I am super excited to see who wins this giveaway. But until then, I do have one more Be Our Guest Express to do this year. This unfortunately was delayed um, a bit. Um, this is the Be Our Guest Express one time Christmas box, the advent box. It is basically seven different small boxes within this box and each I had a plan where every day leading up to Christmas the seven days before Christmas I was gonna open up one of these boxes and have a seven days of Christmas unboxing but with everything going on with the Postal Service and UPS and everything like that there was a delay so it just got here I actually just picked it up so uh, I want to get this filmed so we can do this today Wednesday before we do the actual giveaway announcement video so now that that's out of the way Quickly about Be Our Guest Express, I've uh, talked about them multiple times, but they are basically a Disney-inspired subscription box service where every month, if you're a subscriber to them, you will get a box uh, based on whatever tier you choose, and there are multiple price tiers based on your budget, and they will send you a curated box based on your preferences, so what you like and what you don't like, characters, attractions, movies, everything like that, uh, based on what you like. This, however, is a one-time holiday box, so there was no preference sheet, it was just a one-time box, and I forget off the top of my head how much this was. I will uh, make sure that that's posted somewhere uh, so you can so you can know what the price is, but there might actually be like a spoiler sheet in here, so I don't know. I am just overjoyed with excitement to open this, and so I'm just gonna dive right in. Uh, real quick, I, I just opened a Be Our Guest Express a few days ago, so the box is exactly the same. We've already gone through this. Uh, I will make sure that video is posted so you can watch that one as well. That came out on Christmas morning. So this is what I'm seeing. It looks like a few of the boxes kind of opened up uh, during shipping, so I am going to kind of close those up a little bit just so it's a complete surprise. There we go. So right on top, as always, with every Be Our Guest Express box, we have a Thomas Kincaid postcard. These are not part of the price of the boxes. These are completely separate, just a nice little gift. And this one is called Mickey's Victorian Christmas. See Mickey's hanging up a wreath with Minnie, you have Donald there, uh, pulling a sleigh with some of Mickey's uh, nephews. You have Donald and Daisy, uh, Huey, Dewey, Louis, Huey, Dewey, Lewis, no, Huey, Dewey, and Louie, Goofy, and all the characters. Uh, so this is really nice. So I don't have this one yet, so I'm really excited to have that. So once again, let me show you. So you have seven boxes. You have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and it looks like there's some little, uh, what, probably should have been fortune cookies because there's a piece of paper in there. So there's red and green uh, mashed up fortune cookies, which it's okay. It's not a big deal. I just hope nothing else in here is smashed. Um, so let's see, these have fortunes. It says, welcome surprises. Welcome surprises holiday season and a person near the mistletoe has wishes for kisses. Those are the two fortunes in this. So let's just dive in and see what I got. So box number one, this is advent day number one. And let me just say, these boxes are really cute. I like, it looks like a, a Christmas cookie in the shape of Mickey. And that's really nice. I like that. Okay, so this is, ooh, okay. So this is a sweet treat. It's a gingerbread cookie. Ooh, and that gingerbread smell is fantastic. 
Oh yeah, I love myself some gingerbread. So I'm really excited about this. Advent day one, advent day number two. And here you have a, uh, what's it called? Peppermint ornament in the shape of Mickey. And this looks like an ornament itself. Ooh, I like this. Again, I'm bummed that this box showed up. This is actually being filmed on the 28th of December, uh, coming out on the 30th. So I'm kind of bummed the Christmas tree is gonna be coming down uh, this week, but it's still a really nice ornament to have for next year. You have good tidings with Santa, Mickey, and Mrs. Mickey Claus delivering presents, and then season's greetings where Santa Mickey is giving Minnie Claus a gift. This is really cute. I like this. Uh, and it's from the actual Disney parks. So that's really cool. Okay. Box number three has an ornament, uh, not an ornament, a stocking. Okay, so this kind of feels like a, oh no, it's not a pin. What is this? I think this is a magnet. Looks to be like a magnet to me. Yeah? That's what I think it is. But it's a Mickey Mouse cupcake. Okay, magnets are okay. I'm not a big, yeah, it is a magnet. Stick into the scissors. Uh, I'm not a big magnet guy, uh, but you know, I got a fridge so it'll stick. Number four. Ooh, okay. So this is pins, and it's a set of two pins, and it's Minnie's hands, and they form a little heart. That's really cute. Oh, that is really cute. I like that. That is nice. Okay, so so far two of the guest days, one and two, were holiday themed. Day three was just like a cupcake, a Mickey cupcake, not really Christmas themed. And four almost seems like a Valentine's Day theme. So uh, that's fine. Day five. Okay, so we have Mickey's Cocoa, and this has candy cane flavored. Ooh. Oh. Ooh, that smells good. And as luck would have it in California right now, it is like drizzly, it's a, it's a rain, it's gonna be a rainy night. So this will be nice to make some fresh hot cocoa. Put a little bit of rum in there and enjoy the rain while I watch a good movie. Number six. Okay. So, <laughs> these are kind of cute. These are mini socks. Um, you know, I probably won't wear these. I might give these to my mom or my sister-in-law or someone. Um, I do like Disney socks, but uh, I'm not gonna wear mini. So that's cool. That's a that's a gift for someone else. Okay, and then finally, we have a red box with number seven hiding the label. So I am going to throw the main box on the floor and here we go now there are some holiday gym shorts I've really been wanting so there is like that Donald Duck Nutcracker one I've wanted and this could be that shape uh, there's a Mickey Mouse one in like Father Christmas clothes like and I say Father Christmas instead of Santa Claus because there's a difference between Santa Claus, which is like bright red, you know, kind of jolly, and Father Christmas is like that dark maroon, uh, deeper toned colors. So, 
Let's just open it up and see what it is. Okay, so it is Christmas themed. It's not either of the ones that I thought. Uh, let me pull the tag off real quick. It is Minnie Mouse sipping on some hot chocolate. And she's sitting on a very big present and this is called Chocolate Delight. This is a pretty cute one. I don't really collect many, um, but this is still a cute one to have. It'll be a nice decoration for next year at Christmas. Uh, but I'm kind of getting a little bit of a theme. I'm getting a lot more um, of a feminine vibe off of this box. I mean, if even if you look at the, the cookie, it almost looked like that's like a pearl necklace kind of thing. Um, the Coco's got a female gingerbread character. These are Minnie's hands, Minnie's socks, and a mini Jim Shore. So I'm wondering if this is, if there were like two different advent box types. Maybe there's a, a male one and a female one, or, or if the advent boxes were just more uh, feminine. Uh, I'm fine with everything in this. Like I said, the socks, the, the pins I really like. I like those pins. Um, Cameron and I can each have one and just, you know, combine them. But uh, the rest of it's kind of, it, it's got an almost feminine uh, mini vibe, obviously. So um, overall, this was, it's, it's a good box. I do like it. Um, I didn't see any spoiler sheet or anything. So I know that these were like, basically all the same. I'm assuming everyone got the same stuff. Uh, I've been avoiding watching other people's advent box unbo uh, advent box unboxings just because I wanted to be surprised. Um, so there it is. Uh, I will be honest. Um, I do like to be honest. This box was not really my cup of tea. Uh, out of this box, I really like the gingerbread cookie. I do like the ornament a lot. And then the pins are pretty cute, but the rest were kind of really not my cup of tea. Um, I do know that this was a one-time holiday box. There was no preference sheets filled out for it. So it is nothing against Be Our Guest Express. It's just this box itself wasn't for me. Um, I definitely will. I have tried other Be Our Guest Express holiday boxes and they've always been fantastic. This is the first time I've ever been kind of like eh about it. But like I said, the socks are a great gift to give to someone. The hot chocolate does smell good. And this will be a very nice like holiday once next year, 2021 comes around for Christmas to put out as a centerpiece around like the stockings or the, uh, the Christmas cards or something like that. So overall a very nice box. Uh, but to be honest, just not my type of box. So uh, I, I really hope I'm not offending anyone or anything like that. I'm just trying to be honest about it. Uh, so yeah, that's it. This was this was nice. Again, I was really hoping this was going to show up earlier. Uh, I'm not blaming Be Our Guest Express at all. I know shipping everywhere right now is kind of just all over the place. Uh, in fact, I haven't received any mail since the 23rd. Um, just I don't know what's going on. So. Uh, so yeah, so I'm not blaming them at all. I know things are crazy right now. So that's it. I hope you really enjoyed this box. If you did uh, get this box, I'm very curious. Uh, did you get the same items or were they a little bit different for everyone? Uh, was there a male version and a female version or, or what? Uh, so I'm really curious about that. If you like this video, please make sure you give it a big thumbs up and leave me a comment letting you know if you have tried this box and what you got. Uh, also, please consider subscribing to my channel and make sure you hit that bell notification so you can be notified when I upload more magical content just like this. Don't forget, tomorrow's video comes out and it will be the winner 
video for the giveaway. So I will be announcing who won the giveaway as well as my future plans for this channel in 2021. It's basically gonna just be a quick, let you know what I'm doing and then we'll do the giveaway winner. Okay, so I hope you enjoyed this video. Again, I feel bad for saying I, this box wasn't really my cup of tea. I just wanna be honest. Uh, and like I said, I've, this is the first box out of many that I've got from Beer Guest Express that just wasn't on the mark for me. And I will say in their defense, this was not a preference box. This was purely, uh, they, they built these and uh, just mini's not my, my thing. So that's, that's, that's all it is. If it was, even if it was Daisy, maybe I'd be a little bit more for it. Just not a big mini fan. Uh, so yeah, so that's it. Uh, I hope you have a fantastic rest of your day. Don't forget tomorrow's video is a big one. And until next time, or until tomorrow, uh, never ever forget that we are Ohana, and Ohana means family.